show this after this afternoon was Johnny Rutherford, but this is what happened on his second lap of qualifying in turn number three yesterday. Well, Rutherford had already qualified fast enough to get into the field. You can see how violent that crash was. We're going to have a replay for you in slow motion to get an idea of what happened. Johnny hauls her down into turn number three. The car appears simply to get away from him. They're not absolutely certain whether or not something broke or he just lost it. The car has not made any contact with anything yet. That's just the air that's hitting that car improperly. Of course, the cars are designed to go forward with all the aerodynamics and just the violence of the air at almost 200 miles an hour begins to rip the bodywork away from that car even before it makes contact. He made contact with the left rear quarter panel and Johnny's head came very close to hitting that outside retaining wall. But Johnny Rutherford was not injured, and they've elected not to start today, even though they had a backup car on the grounds. Needless to say, the car was badly damaged. They did have a backup here, but they decided not to go with it. Dick Ferguson in car number 11 is on pit road. He is not out.